Well, hello guys. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to the Big Fat Psychic channel. I'm so pleased to be reading again for you today. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, we're going to look at the uh, Montecito Mansion. Okay, something tells me between Netflix and uh, Megan, uh, there's something going uh, uh, on. So who, who knows what that could be? Who knows what that could be? Uh, just to uh, thank you all for those that have uh, uh, give me feedback uh, this week. Uh, amazing, amazing uh, feedback uh, again. I just love it. I just love how I can just see your life, you know, just see your, your life. And even in your first question, then I know where I'm going and the flow of uh, everything, you know, uh, I just, yeah, it's lovely. It's lovely. And thank you very much. You are uh, amazing. Okay. Anybody wanting a uh, uh, reading? Oops. Anybody wanting a uh, reading? Uh, just look in the uh, description uh, below uh, and click on that link. I don't know what to do about all these uh, feedbacks that I'm getting. I might just start putting them at the end of videos or something or you know just a a, a few words of what's said anyway okay so let's get into it then so you know how does megan feel about uh the montecito mansion oh well you know we've definitely got leaving uh leaving 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 Why does she want to leave? Yeah, because it wasn't hers in the first place, you know. So they've got a... It's not that it wasn't hers. I do believe she's involved, but I just feel like maybe renting or, uh, you know, contracts. And then if you sell uh, the house... If you leave the house that you rent... And then you say you're going to sell it. I mean, how does that look? Uh, and then it's all sorts of complications uh, for, for others. Do Megan and Harry uh, own that house? Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Okay, so uh, this uh, is... Uh, something that will be revealed to us, okay? Uh, will it be revealed in the end that Meghan and Harry do not own this house? Well, you know, it's how the, how do you cope uh, with, with this? How do you cope um, saying, lying that you've bought a house and then it's not yours to sell? And I think, you know, this house had been on the market for quite a while anyway. I don't know why they don't do anything uh, properly. Uh, I really uh, don't. And Meghan and Harry having to pay, ex you know, taxes uh to the to the government are they having to pay the taxes on the house no no so that means it's the owner maybe who pays the ta you know the person who owns the house pays the taxes i got a lot of uh, spite and anger here and not wanting to uh, look bad here, you know, so this could be, this could be a problem, okay, it could be a, a problem. Who does own the house? Who does the house belong to? Uh, a family, you know, who are a lot happier uh, than Meghan and Harry. Um, a family, that's what I get, a big family. So the guy uh, who owns this, he's got a, a wife and she's plump. She, that's what I say, she's plump, she looks plump. Uh, she's plump. And the kids are older. Uh, the kids are a, a, a lot older.
so to a family i do not see it that this is this megan's family yes or no i ain't gonna i just want an up or down no. it looks like they were supposed to decide whether uh, there was, you know, with a view to purchasing it, with a view to purchasing it, but it, nothing was uh, actually finalised. Well, I don't know. I don't know why people would maybe live in a house in an area uh, and just test it out and then never get uh, very far. So this isn't, uh, you know, this this is... Will we ever, will the truth ever be revealed that Megan about Montecito uh, mansion? Will the truth ever uh, be revealed? Well, it'll cause a lot of uh, upsetment, a lot of upsetment uh, as well. And it comes on top of a time that uh, Harry and Megan are already uh, hitting the skids, uh, should we say. Uh, hitting uh, the skids. Now, Megan feels tied up in this and bound, uh, you know, to say nothing, but she could actually get herself out of this by saying something. I mean, do you not think when you go in and say that you're renting somewhere, or when you're renting somewhere and you say that you own the house, that when you leave it, it doesn't go up for sale? All I can say is, you know, she's going to despair over this. Because this is all about caring what other people think, you know. Uh, she, she wanted people to believe that they had the money and that they was, uh, you know, going to spend, uh, what is it, like nearly, I mean, $15 million. If, so if Harry has, uh, you never spend 25% of your income uh, on a house. Uh, unless you know you're gonna get more money in, you know. Um, I I don't believe this. I just feel like it was there was an agreement to, and then they they haven't uh, got round to it. They haven't got round to it. Do Harry and Meghan uh, ever? Do they have? I saw a place before. I actually saw it like properly in my head. Um. Properly made. How does that sound? <laughs> Bloody hell. Um, yeah, I, I saw it and it was nothing like what uh, they did. It was like a, a place that you would just probably go to every now and again. It wasn't a fantastic uh, house. I've seen better uh, on The Real Housewives. Uh, it was nothing like that, actually. I think I said like a condo uh does harry own any property in the states well he would have problems he would have uh, problems buying somewhere in the states i don't know he has problems does megan have anything in her name in the states another property Well, you get kind of uh, other problems, don't you? Other people uh, causing uh, problems. So it's possible that they don't own any property. Does Megan, own, Megan and Harry own any property in the uh, States? No, not as yet, but they're looking, looking uh, to, they're looking uh, to buy. So they, you know, they're probably renting their uh, places out uh, all over the show. Let's have a look. Are they uh, renting other properties? Yes, and I think we're going to find out about it uh, uh, as well. You know, they change things all, all the time, so they might uh, rent somewhere there and then uh, want to rent somewhere else. And, you know, uh, they're, so, like, they're constantly moving as if they're on the run, 
you know. I feel like that, as if they're on the run. So then it begs me to ask the question, what do Netflix know about this home? Montecito Mansion. Well, they've got their wishes. They've got their uh, wishes. So they know something. There's something damaging. And Netflix. Involved with... Uh, I mean, that would make a great movie. That's what I get. That would make a great movie. What do uh, Netflix know? They know an awful lot. They know an awful, awful uh, lot. I know that Megan wishes, uh, you know, uh, to purchase uh, it. I, I just don't see that they are, are in this. I see that there's other places. Do Netflix... Did Netflix have any... So, all right, yes or no, and I'm not going to turn a card, but did Netflix... Do they have any money invested in that Montecito mansion? No. Andrew was saying that, look. Don't want to look bad to others. Uh, they, they would be uh, hiding it, hiding it. Oh, uh, now I get you. Let's have a look then. Okay. Let's have a look. Is Montecito Mansion rented by Netflix? <laughs> oh my god i'll tell you why i read on this because uh, in one of my uh grainy uh readings that it came up uh as netflix absolutely 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 you know they they've got the the wishes here they've got the wishes but why for what reason would netflix rent montecito or they could be paying rent to uh, Montecito uh, as well. Go on, why? It was the agreement and they had the money. They've rented it. No, why would they do that? Because if it was a reality... Uh, TV and there's filming done there, uh, even if it's occasionally uh, or working. It can be uh, that you know that's how it can be dealt with. That's how it can be uh, dealt with. Oh, they they definitely definitely uh, gave money for this, uh, so they're paying uh, rent and that's their wishes. Oh my God! Will Netflix ever uh, do a film and reveal uh, their truth about Harry and Meghan? And their duplicitous dealings. <laughs> of course I will. Of course I will. I don't know. Megan will be up and she's dead and buried. I mean, you know. So it is quite right. So I know uh, that the Netflix uh, are paying for it. Now, this is nothing to do with... It just simply been their their money, it, like hundred million. Okay, so they're actually directly uh, paying for this. Did Netflix own the property before Megan? Yes or no? Just a yes or no, please. No, uh, I'll go for a full card then. Uh, okay, uh, did Netflix own the property before Megan? Absolutely. I would say it was them that found them the place. They they gave them uh, their place. They found the place. But why? Why would Netflix do that?
So maybe from Tyler Perry's uh, to there, uh, I know, like, we, we all know things went on at Tyler Perry's, okay, but it's just that, that this, the way they saw things, you, you know, uh, they didn't see why they had to move out of Tyler's. Uh, they didn't see why they have to go uh, uh, and buy a, a place in, in the States, you know. Um, I, I just see that they didn't really know what they wanted and uh, Netflix uh, formed it uh, as a base for them. So I do believe that, you know, uh, something about this Montecito mansion and bloody Netflix uh, and, and paying uh, rent and we know that they're going to be uh, exposed. You know, uh, how does uh, Megan feel uh, about the house and Netflix? Well, she knows it doesn't belong to them. Is she afraid uh, this would come out? It's not reality, you know, they, ne they never bought it. So this, I'm thinking it is uh, Netflix who, uh, so like, have some involvement, uh, m major involvement, okay? So they're responsible for Montecito, uh, not, not Meghan and Harry. I is she worried about it? Well, she should be, because it's not reality, you know? Uh, it it's not reality. I just think maybe Meghan and Harry uh, swanned around uh, thinking that, you know, looking at somewhere and they was never actually going to get somewhere, you know, that would live up to the, 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 what Meghan and Harry uh, wanted. They've paid for it. They've paid. I, I get bought and paid, bought and paid. <clears throat> um. So what will happen to the house uh, in the end then? You know, what will Netflix do with the house in the end? What will they do with it? It's coming out. It's coming out. Will it be revealed uh, then that... Will it be revealed that Netflix uh, rent the house and not Harry and Meghan? That's a full-on yes. Uh, a full-on uh, yes. So you've got the uh, PLC companies and all like that and uh, how it can be rented. They've got... You know, all, all those kind of uh, support systems in place so that uh, this couldn't be revealed. But I actually do feel that uh, it will be uh, revealed, okay? It absolutely uh, will. And Netflix, they have the story. They have the billion-dollar story. Does that CEO know that he has the real Megan and Harry, uh, billion dollar story. Does he know? Yeah, he does. He absolutely uh, does. Okay, absolutely. And they've done it all themselves and they've volunteered it all themselves. They know exactly, uh, you know, what stuff is uh, going on. And there's obviously uh, more as well. Wait till the withdraw, you know, wait, wait till the withdraw. Yeah, I mean, this is just a story in itself, isn't it? I mean, do you know what? Actually, yeah, Netflix has got its own story. He's not ready to do it yet. He's not ready to do it uh, yet. Uh, it, it'll let things die down a, a little. Um, but, yeah, you know, the Netflix uh, 100 million uh, scam is the story. Okay, that's the film we want to see. That is it, isn't it? You know, uh, that that's what brings them their money in. 
Uh, and I'm sure uh, Netflix, Netflix uh, have joked uh, uh, amongst this uh, about themselves. But, you know, uh, yeah, definitely, definitely. So uh, I don't care what anybody says. That house and Netflix, there's something going off there uh, and it will be exposed. OK, guys, uh, that's it from me. Thank you very much. And I'll be back soon with another reading. OK, bye now. Bye bye. <laughs>